Well, today, single women can face certain challenges, whether it's societal pressure or judgment from friends. Finding Mr. Right can be stressful. Lindsley Lowell is the author of My Night in Shining Armor is Coming. He's just stuck in traffic. Witty title. She joins us live in studio now to talk about the stigmas of being single and why women shouldn't settle. Welcome, Lindsay. Thank you Good for morning, being with Serene. us. Good morning, Thank you. Happy to be here. So first of all, the title. How did you come up with yes. this title for the book, Lindsay? Well, you know, I'm waiting and waiting and waiting for the right guy. And I said to myself, is he ever going to come? And so I started making jokes. I said, oh, well, he's just stuck under a really heavy rock. You know, oh, he hasn't gotten out of prison yet. And I said, you know, you know what? He's just stuck in traffic. That's where he is. Just stuck yeah. in traffic. Yeah. And did your night finally arrive? He did. He got out of traffic, mm -hmm. um, which what felt like about 873 years. But he got out, and uh, I am married now. Okay. So. Yes. So dating can be difficult. That's one oh. of the complaints I do hear from a lot of my single friends, mm -hmm. especially in Los Angeles. Dating can be so tough. Why is it so challenging? And why do you think women are having a hard time finding their night? I think it's hard because everyone is very fickle. You know, they want the perfect person. They're scared. I think fear is a big issue. You know, women say, I'm scared to put myself out there. I'm scared to trust that, you know, this person's going to be good to me, good to my heart. So it is, you have to put it out there and you have to have hope. Um, a lot of society tells us you're not going to find someone. You know, you're over 35, forget it. Just throw in the towel, go find anyone, find anyone to marry you, which is just an awful way to treat women. Right. And, you know, men don't have that issue. Women do. Mm -hmm. So you have to believe in yourself and know that you are worth true love and that it is out there. It does exist. And you say, don't settle, no. but don't be too picky. Yeah, you need to be picky, picky, not nitpicky. Right. So that means, you know, you know what you want, okay? And, you know, I said to my friends, my friends were like, oh, you know what, you're too picky. I said, I'm too picky? I said, no, I'm, I need to be more picky. Mm -hmm. I'm like, do you remember the dates I've had? Horrible dates, real with idiots. I said, no, I know what I want. You know, I want a regular guy with a job, with you know some sort of brain, you might, right. maybe half good looking. These are not challenging things, but so you need to stick with what you know you want. Okay. Yes. And what about online dating? Because I know some women have mixed emotions about that. You support online dating. I do. Um, it's like a roller coaster, and you have to have the stomach for it. So this goes ups and downs and it twirls around and you know by the end of some of the days and dates you might want to throw up. And I'm not kidding. But you have to stick with it because it is a ride and you do get to your destination um, from online dating. So it worked for me but you have to be patient and be realistic. Take a deep breath and just stick with it. There are good guys out there. Now, I recently read an article that said more and more women are choosing to stay single these days because, of course, there are more financial opportunities, career opportunities, and you don't necessarily have to have a man to have a baby in this day and age. Um, but you say a lot of women are maybe hi hiding behind a facade? Uh, yeah, I personally think that's rubbish because <laughs> women want to be loved. And I think it's a wonderful thing to be loved and be in a loving relationship, and it is in our nature to want that. Mm -hmm. So women who say, oh, I don't, I don't want a man, they are, they probably got very hurt. Mm -hmm. um, I have a friend right now who is divorced and she says right now, I don't want a man, I want to be alone. Mm -hmm. And I, I, I get that, right. you know, because she's been very hurt. The guy was awful, cheated, you know, everything. So I understand that, but most women do want a loving relationship and it's okay to admit that. You know, what is so wrong with saying, I want love, I want to be loved, I want to be in a relationship. Women are very scared of saying that and they shouldn't be afraid to admit that. It's a good thing, it's okay. a good thing. All right. Well, Lindsay Lowell, thank you so much for thank being here. You. Very useful advice. I know a lot of my lady friends out there will be listening to that. Right. And of course, for more information about Lindsay's book, you can go to our website, kcal9.com. Just click on the scene on TV link.